if your metabolism feels broken, this might be why. Dieting without micronutrients is like trying to start a car with no fuel. You can be eating in a calorie deficit every single day and still not lose weight. And today I'm going to show you the surprising reason why. Most people are told weight loss is simple. Just eat less than you burn. But if you've tried that and nothing's happening, it's not because you're doing it wrong. It's because fat loss doesn't depend on calories alone. Your body actually needs certain micronutrients, vitamins and minerals to unlock and burn fat as energy. And if you're missing them, your metabolism slows down, your hormones get confused, and your body literally cannot tap into stored fat. Here's why a calorie deficit isn't always enough. Let's break it down simply. A calorie deficit tells your body, hey, we need energy, let's burn some fat. But your body can't burn fat effectively without help. It needs little chemical tools, micronutrients, to make the whole metabolism process work. Think of it like a factory. The calorie deficit is the signal to start production, but micronutrients, they're the workers, tools, and the electricity. So no tools, no workers, no energy, production stops. That's exactly what happens to your fat loss. The micronutrients your metabolism needs. This is where most people get stuck. You cut calories, but you also cut nutrients, especially if your diet becomes mostly coffee, protein bars, low calorie snacks, and salads with no real variety. Here are the most common micronutrient deficiencies that stop fat loss. B vitamins, and not just one like B12, all of them. These are your energy converters. You need these to turn carbs and fat into usable energy. Low B vitamins equals a slow metabolism and low energy. Magnesium, the metabolism stabilizer. Over 300 reactions in your body need magnesium, including fat oxidation. If you're low, your body struggles to break down fat. Iron, the oxygen transporter. Low iron equals low oxygen delivery equals low energy equals low fat burning ability. Vitamin D, the hormone balance. Vitamin D affects insulin, appetite hormones, and fat storage. Most people are deficient without knowing, especially if you're about to go through a Midwest winter. Zinc, the fat loss enabler. Low zinc disrupts thyroid hormones, which control your metabolic rate. Symptoms, you're missing these nutrients. If you're in a calorie deficit and still not losing weight, watch for these signs. Stubborn belly fat, fatigue no matter how much you sleep, cravings for carbs or sugar, cold hands and feet, hair loss, feeling hungry but not losing weight. These are your body's warning signs that you're running low on essential nutrients. How to fix it without complicating your diet. This doesn't mean you need to take a million supplements, but it does mean your calorie deficit needs quality, not just quantity. Here's what actually works. Eat at least one micronutrient dense meal per day. Examples, salmon, veggie, avocado, eggs, spinach, berries, lean beef, sweet potato, green. Add color to your plate. More colors equals more micronutrients. A beige plate means nutrient light. Check one or two key supplements if needed. Real food is always the better route. Not medical advice, but many people benefit from magnesium glycinate, vitamin D3, a high quality B complex. Stop surviving on a low calorie processed food diet. Just because it fits your macros doesn't mean it fuels your metabolism. So here's the takeaway. If you're stuck in a caloric deficit, frustrated and feeling like your body is broken, it's not, it's just missing the raw materials it needs to burn fat effectively, fix the, fix the micronutrients, and suddenly the calorie deficit starts working again. If this explained what's really going on with your metabolism, hit that like button and subscribe. For more science-backed nutrition and fat loss content, and let me know in the comments, have you been stuck in a calorie deficit before? 
what did you notice? I'd love to help break it down. You can probably find a link in the description. Stay strong.